Okay, so, um, <laughs> this is going to be a quick intro because, uh, if you look down here, and I know my face is kind of covering it on the side here, there's a lot here, but, um, I thought, you know what, why not go back to my childhood? Uh, I feel like I personally probably watch Cartoon Network more than Disney Channel or Nick, um, but I will, I'll, I'll do one for Nick and I'll do one for Disney too, um, but I just thought, you know, I saw this, <laughs> I'm going to purposely make this fast. I don't know every show on here. Not everything looks familiar to me. Um, so, you know, obviously, I'm I'm so glad whoever made this, you know, literally put <laughs> put this down here. So, um, well, again, let's get right into it. Uh, real quick, though, put ideas down in the comments below. I already had some uh, that I am going to be planning on doing later on this month. Um, I am recording about four in a row, five in a row right here, right now. So, uh, you'll see these over the, the next week. <laughs> And then uh, we'll get into more of the other stuff, uh, some of the stuff that was commented and whatnot, too, again, a little later in the month. So, uh, this, I feel like it's an older show, and I never watched that. Uh, 16, oh, I don't know, I don't really remember that. A Pup Named Scooby-Doo, I never, <laughs> I, I, I don't really remember that. Adventure Time, I, it's okay. I, I thought it started out okay. I personally, once it got to like the, the uh, what I call the romance part where they really got into it and then Finn started like dating around and all this stuff and they really focused on Finn with a girl uh, and then uh, they focused on Jake with a unicorn uh, rainbow thing. <laughs> it's just, eh, I fell out of it. I, I don't remember. I've seen that this guy looks familiar, but I don't really remember a lot of it. Gumball, I like Gumball. I do like Gumball a lot. Uh, Apple and Onion, I didn't really watch it. Uh, I have no idea <laughs> what that is. Baby Looney Tunes, I didn't really watch that. I didn't really care. Um, I don't remember a lot of that. We'll put it in. We'll put it here. Uh, Batman was just the Brave and the Bold. I thought it was okay. I thought it was okay. Uh, <laughs> the original, is this the, I think this is the second one. I did like the second one too. And then it kind of slowly started to, you know, fall off and I, I never well I didn't really watch this but I've heard of it but I never really watched it uh another Batman see I don't this one does not look familiar so I don't think I watched that one uh Cam oh Camp Lazlo oh my god I forgot that was this show I I've seen I've seen a couple things of it oh no I'm thinking of uh was it my uh was it uh my gym partner's a monkey I think is the one I'm thinking of is that yeah here it is I was, that one's okay. I'll put that on. I'll leave it here. I'll, I'll put that one. I don't. That's the one I'm thinking of. <laughs> I I don't really remember Camp Lazlo a lot. Uh, I never watched this. This was before my time. I don't know what that is. Chowder, Chowder's okay. I think Chowder was good. Clarence is. It was okay. I don't. That does. <laughs> that looks like that was a '90s show. So that was probably a good show. But I have no idea what that is. Cloud at the Chance of Meatballs. <laughs> I didn't even know there was a, a show for that. Code. Oh, my God. I don't. I've heard of that, but I don't remember that. Oh, my. Uh, are you, like. <laughs> everyone I talk to loves KND. Uh, Courage. I love Courage, too. Courage is fun. Um, I didn't really watch that show. It's okay. Courage is okay. Uh, you know, I'll put it in good. Um. This looks like a 90s show. I have no idea what that is. I have... What, what? Is that like a... I don't even know what that is. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what that is. Uh, Dexter's... We'll put Dexter's in great. Why not? Why not? Uh, I have heard of this. I think it's okay. Oh, I did not watch. I've heard of that, but I have not watched it. Ed, Ed, and Eddie. I'll put that up there. I love that. Oh, yeah. There's still so many more. <laughs> Don't know what this is. Foster's is okay. Uh, didn't really watch it. I think I've heard of it. Generation Rex is an interesting one. I thought it was okay. Uh, I never finished it, but I thought it was okay. Is that George of the Jungle? I don't really remember. <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, no idea what Green Lantern is. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Billy and Mandy. Oh, my God. I love that show. Wait, was this a spinoff? Was that a Grimm spinoff? 
I do not. I'm gonna have to look that up after. <laughs> I do not remember that. I didn't know Grim had a spinoff. <laughs> uh, what's that? He Man. I have no idea what that is. No idea. Uh, that looks like a '90s show. Johnny Bravo. I never. I've heard of Johnny Bravo, but I never really watched it. Infinity Train. I, I've never. Uh, Johnny, okay, I, I know people are probably not going to like that, but I didn't think Johnny Test was bad. I didn't think it was bad at all. Uh, <laughs> Justice League, oh my god. This one I don't really remember. Um, This one, we'll put it in great, and I'll probably put this. I'm trying to remember these shows. I'm really trying to remember. Crypto, I don't even remember that. I have no idea what that is. I have no idea what that is. Uh... Something Royals, I don't know. I, eh, eh, that's okay. I have heard of that. I don't really remember that, but I remember that I remember something called Mad, but I don't remember that. Uh, I have heard of that, but I never watched it. Flapjack was okay. I'll put it in there. It's mediocre. I'll just put okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, I have no idea what that is. Oh, you know, I only know this because there's. I saw a commercial for some website for it. I have that looks like a '90s show. Mixels, I've heard of that, but I never watched it. The Moxie show. Oh, I have heard of this, and I don't remember a single thing about it. <laughs> uh, Ninjago was. Uh, I I really only watched like the first season. I think it was okay. I remember that as a kid. Uh, okay, KO, I've heard of that. I never watched that. I don't know if that's good or not. I have heard of this, too. I watched, like, one episode. I don't, don't really remember it. Uh, Part of Puff Girls will put in, will put in good. Don't know what this is. Oh, is this, wait, is this the old one? Uh, well, I, I didn't watch the new one. <laughs> I, I've heard of that. I didn't really watch that. Oh, my, regular show. I love regular show. I'll put that in great. I thought, I thought that was a good show. Uh, never heard of that. Never heard of that. <laughs> Samurai Jack is one of those shows where, uh, I had to catch up late. <laughs> Gee, because when I was a kid, I never found it appealing, but then I grew up and I'm like, yeah, it's actually an interesting show. Um, this, this, this Scooby-Doo, I'll put it in good too. I'll put it in good too. I thought that was a decent one. Oh my God. I think I've heard of that, but I've never watched that. Uh, Secret Saturday. I remember being like, I remember thinking, you know, I would like to see more of it, but never really got an extra uh, any more of it. So, uh, Sonic. I've heard of it. I didn't really watch it. Uh, this was in that looks like it's '90s. Squirrel Boy. I feel like I've heard of that. If I watch an episode of it, maybe I can remember. Uh, oh, this is this is the animation or the yeah animation. This one is the CG. Uh, this was, that was one of my shows. Every Friday, that was one of my shows where it's like, yeah, I'm coming home. I'm, you know, I'm making sure all my homework's done. And I'm watching that at like, what is it? Seven or eight, eight or whatever it was. Uh, Static Shock. I've only seen like one episode, so I'm going to put that there. Steven Universe. Eh. Eh. Eh, it was okay. I never really, you know, I watched some of it. Uh, I, I actually, like a year ago, I went back and finally watched the movie of that. And I just, you know. Whatever. Uh, don't know what that is. Don't know what summer camp is. This looks like a 90s show. That looks like a 90s show. Uh, Symbiotic Titan. I've heard of that. Don't really pay too much attention. Teen Titans Go. <laughs> Actually, the funny thing, they had the movie on TV one time, and I think I watched part of that. Uh, original Teen Titans, that was, you know, love that too. There's some Thundercats, I don't know. Tegan Sneak, what the heck? Something Squad, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Um, okay, so now, the original I thought was good, but as it went on, the seasons went on with, you know, different casts and whatnot, kind of like some of them felt like repetitive characters just in, you know, a different, you know, person. It just, you know, all right, so I'll put, I'll put it in great because I, I love the early on show for it. Uh, Ridiculous Rage? I don't know. 
I have heard of that. I, 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 I've heard of that. I've never really watched it. Some Transformers. Eh. Uncle Grandpa. I've heard of that. Didn't really watch it. This, I, I know, I, the only reason I know about this is because there was some spinoff of the Lego movie. So that's why I know what the Unikitty thing is. But I never watched it, but I've heard of it. Uh, Victor and Valentine. I've seen a couple. I'll put, I'll put it in okay. I've seen a couple episodes here and there. Uh, villainous? I don't know. Uh, we Bear Bears. I have seen a couple of that, too. I'll put that. I'll put that in good. What a cartoon. I don't know. What's a cartoon? <laughs> don't know. Oh, this is the older Scooby-Doo's. Where'd it go? There it is. I'll put that in great. I'll put that in great. Uh, I've heard of it. I see. I I have heard of that. Young Justice. I I'll put an okay. I remember just. Eh. <laughs> I have heard of that. I've I've heard of the, the. There's the web series. I remember as a kid there was a web series. Uh, but yeah, Young Justice. I don't know. I like. I kind of fell out of it, like, after the first season, so. Thunder. Oh, Thundercats Roar. Is that the... I saw some video. That must be the new one. Where it kind of ruined it. Uh, Old Batman. I'll put that up there. I'll put that up there. Uh, Superman. I see. I'm... Mm. Uh, we'll put it in good. I, I feel like I, I was more of a Batman kid. I, I was more of a Batman kid. I, you know, Superman, it was just whatever for me, but I, I was more of a Batman kid. Um, Elliot, I have heard of that. And then I don't even know if that's still on. We Baby Bears, I saw like one episode of that. Jellystone, I've heard of that, but I don't know really what that is. I have no idea what this is. And then this is Steven Universe Future. I didn't watch that, so. <laughs> okay, is that... <laughs> I don't know how, how long <laughs> the video is. Um, wow, there's a lot of... I feel like... I, I don't know. Some of these, like, don't really appeal to me. Like Again, some of, like, 90s, like, maybe like that. If this is a spinoff of uh, The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy, I feel like I should probably watch that because... I did really enjoy that show as a kid. I really enjoyed that. Um, that spider, uh, that spider guy always creeped me out. And I always loved whenever Billy was like beating it up on accident or whatever. The first time he saw it, he was like beating it up on accident. <laughs> I always loved that. Even though the spider guy creeped me out, Mandy was always a fun character for me too. And then obviously Grim too. Uh, but if that's a spinoff, I don't. I've never. My bad. <laughs> My bad. Uh, like remakes, yeah, whatever. Um, again, this is like '90s. I that's never really heard of that. I feel like I feel like I have maybe. I don't know. Duck Dodgers. That was before my time. Mixels. I don't even remember a thing about. Uh. I mean, I I did I, I did see the movie with my family, but uh, I've never really seen the show really. Um, but the movie was okay, but I, I mean, like, when, when you, when you have this, and then you go down, and you just, like, Robin is not respected or anything, I, come on, man, like, it loses what made it so good, and I'm pretty sure they're all the same voice actors from the original series here, I'm pretty sure all the same voice actors are in, uh, you know, the, the Go, the Teen Titans Go, so, the fact that they're, I, I get it, you're making it for kids and whatnot, but you could at least work on something for older fans, like, come on! <laughs> like, there's still a fan base out there, people still want to, you know, see the Teen Titans, especially because there's been rumors for years about, uh, was it season 5 or season 6, whatever, a last season to wrap it up, season 5 or 6, there's been rumors for years! And they just haven't done it. And then it's like, this came out. It's like, oh, okay, well, now we're not even going to get it. They did have uh, the cameo in the movie. That's the reason why I saw the movie is because uh, I did hear about the cameo from the original ones, but it ended up just being at the end. So, 
Uh, I don't remember like a thing about this show, but I feel like if I if it was better, I would have remembered it. But I have seen some episodes. I do remember watching it every once in a while. This I feel like I've watched this a couple times. I just don't really remember anything. Camp Lasso. Uh, I remember this, and it's more so. It's so weird. I remember this more so for the scenery in the background because you would have a school that's like half destroyed by like. Uh, like a, I guess like a forest setting where it's like, you know, a bunch of vines and trees and everything. So I remember this show mainly for like the scenes behind the characters and whatnot. Um, and I thought it was okay. I remember it being kind of short. I thought it was okay. Uh, Clarence, I thought was, you know, it's okay too. Um, don't really remember too much of it. That theme song is kind of catchy though. That th I'm not going to lie. That theme, theme song is kind of catchy. Uh, I don't remember a lot of it. I think this is supposed to be canon to the franchise, but I just don't remember a lot of it. Uh, I think this is, because there's a movie too, so I think this is canon, or this is before, obviously before the movie. So I think it's, you know, the movie's canon. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. Um, I, I do, as I stated before, I do kind of remember, like, wishing there was more episodes of this. I do remember Secret Saturdays. I was actually just thinking about it, like, a month ago, and it's just like, you know, they're never going to do any more of it. And I remember it being kind of interesting. And it was just like six episodes or whatever. So there wasn't really a lot there. This, uh, you know, I, I I love the Clone Wars more. When they did this, it was okay. I did watch it. It was, it was okay. I just like, <laughs> Ahsoka was just like the GOAT. Like, <laughs> like, you saw Ahsoka just grow into this, you know, powerful Jedi and whatnot throughout the season. You, you know, slowly see Anakin turn. Obi-Wan always steals the show for me in Clone Wars 2. Um, it's just, you know, those three, it's just, I loved it, loved it so much, uh, as a kid, and I, I remember just always, it was seven or eight o'clock, I forget when it was, always made sure I was watching that, so, yeah, it's just, but this was okay. Uh, Steven University, yeah, it started out okay, and then, you know, eh, wasn't really for me, it wasn't for my, uh, you know, the group of people like me, so, <laughs> uh, and then Victor and Valentina, I think it's okay, I mean, I have seen a couple episodes here and there, uh, some stuff is interesting, some stuff is not. Uh, then again, these are kind of like older, you know, older stuff. I do, I should go back and watch this, because I kind of fell out of it. Um, but I remember really liking it, Generation Rex, uh, at first. Um, so I should go back and finish that. I don't even know how it ends, still, so. <laughs> or I don't rem remember if I did ever watch it. Johnny Test, again, I know, there was a lot of complaints about this show. I, I remember a lot of people complaining about this show. Um, you know, happy it ended after like four years or five years, whatever it was. I didn't think it was bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I know that's a hot take. I know, but I I thought it was okay. You know, I, I I didn't think it was like terrible. Like some of these shows down here, it's not you know amazing, spectacular. But I thought there was you know some good things in the show. So it, you know, people are gonna get mad because I know there's a lot of hate for Johnny Test. But I feel like the more time that passes. It might become like a cult classic or something like that eventually. Uh, but, you know, you know, and, and the, theme so <laughs> the theme song is pretty good, too. <laughs> if you have not heard the theme song or you never watched Johnny Test, I do like the theme song, too. So, um, yeah, original Powderpuff Girls, I thought was good. Uh, this is the Mystery Incorporated. I do, like, this is a darker Scooby-Doo. And I I'm, don't think I've seen every episode, but I do remember watching this. Uh, like, was it five years ago or whatever, seven years ago, something like that. Um, I, I remember, I'm like, a darker Scooby-Doo, I'll, ta I'll take it. Uh, you know, growing up, I loved, you know, the What's New Scooby-Doo and whatnot. Uh, got all these old uh, uh, DVDs of, like, the original Scooby-Doo and whatnot. Uh, and so, you know, when, it, when we had a darker one, it's like, oh, hey, I'll, <laughs> I'll gladly take that. I'll gladly love that, um, you know, because... Like, it, it can be dark, but they don't go dark, obviously, for kids. But this is more like a young teen to teen type of Scooby-Doo. Um, but I don't really think people die in the show. So it's not like, you know, flat out like adult, uh, like horror or anything like that. But it is, it's darker. It's darker. Um, I love the theme song for We Bear Bears too. And the funny thing is, it's uh, was it? I think it's Garnet or the 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 person that plays Garnet also sings the song for this. I thought that was okay. Uh, or okay. I th again, I like the theme song and whatnot. I thought the show was okay, pretty good. 
Um, Samurai Jack, again, I got into this late um, because I didn't really watch this as a kid. didn't really find it appealing. Uh, but then I thought it was pretty good when I went back and watched it, uh, you know, when the new stuff came out. But I just, I don't remember a lot of, a lot of it right now. But <laughs> the more I think about it, uh, it's hard to really remember. Uh, again, it's talking about Adventure Time. It's just kind of, I don't know. The deeper it got into the show, it's just like, it didn't feel like what the original Adventure Time was. Um, and to me, that was like, you know, you're like, I want to see this brand new post-apocalyptic world where Finn is supposedly the last human and whatnot. You got talking dogs. You got these long unicorn rainbow things. You you got people made out of bubblegum, Princess Bubblegum, people made out of candy and whatnot. It's like they, they kind of like started that. And then it just like took a right hand turn. And like, oh, we're going to have Finn date a fire princess. We're going to have Finn crush on uh, Princess Bubblegum. And then she's going to turn lesbian at the end. Um, which I still don't know if that was the full intent. Uh, because the like at the start it was like, hey, like you're way too young for me. Because she's what, like 100 some years old or whatever. And Finn, Finn's only like, I think he's like a teen. Like 15 or 16 at the start of the show or whatever. So it's like, I thought, okay, well, you know, he's going to find someone younger or whatever. And then they kind of turned her into a, a, a lesbian and whatnot. I did love uh, Marceline. I thought Marceline, uh, I actually lo uh, absolutely loved her character arc and whatnot throughout the show. Uh, but I, it just, like, it felt so romance-heavy for me. Um, and I, I don't, I, like, I, I can get into that. But, like, when you have, a, again, a show where it's like, hey, like, we could show you a whole a post-apocalyptic world. Of, you know, our stuff. And again, they kind of did that. You have, like, an ice kingdom, a fire kingdom, and whatnot. But again, then they just, then they just kind of focused on, like, romance so much. And it just kind of took me out of it. And I remember, you know, I stepped back. I stepped away from Adventure Time for, like, two years. And I, I you know, went and got back and kind of caught up and whatnot. And I'm like, you know, I'm kind of glad I watched it that way. Because then you can kind of just, like, speed through and you're not waiting weekly for stuff. Um, anymore, and just, I, I enjoyed it more so, you know, when I could just go through quickly rather than wait a week and let, you know, it sit in my mind and think, oh, you know, that episode was okay, I might not watch it, uh, next week and whatnot, so, again, that's just my opinion, some people might love Adventure Time, some people might hate Adventure Time, I, again, I thought it started out good and then just kind of slowly dropped, <laughs> uh, moving up to Great Gumball, I, I, <laughs> I, I still will laugh at some of these jokes and whatnot in this show, um, I, I think Gumball and Darwin are just, like, they, they made it perfect. I thought this was, like, a really good show. Um, th you know, this started when I was, like, a teen, so, um, I think it's middle school is what they're in, so it wasn't really, you know, targeted at me, but there's a lot of adult jokes and whatnot, uh, a lot of stuff that's for, you know, like, teens and adults in this show, so you're not just a kid where it's like, okay, you, you know, you may understand as a kid, but then you're going to understand it differently as an adult. So I feel like when I become 30 years old or whatever, and wa if I watch this again, I feel like, yeah, I see it in a whole different perspective, and I see it, <laughs> and I might like it even more, or I might not like it as much as I do right now. But uh, I just, I really do enjoy that. Um, this was, yeah, Ultimate Alien. You know, the, the original, we'll just kind of skip up here to Ben 10 real quick. I thought the original show, this aired when I was, you know, like eight, seven or eight. Um, so, you know, that was my, I was the target graph, our, our target audience for it. Um, I love the original Ben 10. I thought, you know, having him grow up a little bit and whatnot, Kevin turned good, uh, you know, all that stuff. Gwen gets more powerful and whatnot with her magic uh, or whatever they call it or energy or whatever. I forget what they call it. But I'm like, oh, yeah, you know, that's good. And then kind of slowly just, I don't know, I kind of phased out of Ben 10 and slowly decided to, you know, feel worse to me. Like, I... I don't like the character design like this, especially after, like, this This felt kind of consistent, and, and then this is, I feel like this is like a whole nother timeline, Ben. That's <laughs> what the, that kind of feels like to me. And then, obviously, you have the reboot down here, which, well, I didn't watch it, but that does not look like, you know, it'd be any good, so, <laughs> you know. Uh, Dexter's Laboratory, I don't even, do I even need to? I don't, I don't need to talk about Dexter's Laboratory, do I? Uh, do I need to talk about Ed, Ed, and Eddie? I feel like I don't. I feel like a, a lot of people enjoy this show, too. I, I feel like some of these, again, 90s, early 2000s show, I feel like a lot of people really love. I feel like I don't need to talk about these. Or, like, Justice League. Like, I feel like a lot of people really watch this stuff. Uh, regular show, 
I guess I could touch on that real quick. Uh, I enjoyed it. I, I, you know, I feel like, I, cause I have seen some of it. You know, we watched some of it now. I did just watch the movie again recently. You know, when it first aired when I was a kid, I saw stuff differently then than I do now. You see a lot more adult jokes and whatnot in this. Um, you know, I, I feel like I see the progression of the characters, especially of you know Rigby and Mordecai again, the main characters in the show. Um, I still love Skips. Skips is probably my favorite character of the show. Uh, but you know that that ending with Pops, man. Ah, oh, ah. Oh. <laughs> still, I still will think about it every once in a while now, uh, or every once in a while. And you know, it's it that sucks. Like it, it still hurts to this day. It's like it's such a good ending to me. I, I enjoy that ending. Uh, talked about that Batman. Do I like? Do do I even need to? No. <laughs> uh, courage. Uh, yeah, oh yeah, we're gonna leave him for the end, or them for the end. Uh, courage, yeah. Uh, I, like this, this was, this is a goat show. If you have not seen Courage, I recommend going and seeing it. It is, you know, it's kind of creepy and there's kind of stuff where it's like kind of weird and you know not you might not quite understand. But if you watch like the whole show, kind of stitches things together. Um, I just, I love this show, you know, Courage and his scream. Uh, <laughs> when Eustace always pulls out the mask and goes, Booga, booga, booga. <laughs> I die every time at that. And Courage flips out and goes, ah, just you. <laughs> I always love those little jokes. You have Muriel, you know, protecting Courage. Um, and then, you know, Courage protects Muriel from all the monsters and whatnot in Nowhere. Um, so yeah, just, yeah, <laughs> love that. Uh, and then K, K I, where, where do I begin? Like, this might be, ah, uh, but T Teen Titans is really good too. I, this might be one of my, like, maybe the best show I've watched. Like, this, this might be my favorite kids show on Cartoon Network. Uh, again, T Teen Titans is up there too. Uh, Billy and Mandy Courage are up there too. The original Ben 10 is up there too. But K and I just, I fell in love instantly with it you know you had a whole cast of characters um i always like i feel like i i enjoy number four a lot um number five in that little romance and whatnot that they had i i, I enjoyed that kind of crap um like again like adventure time again you know but it was different here like obviously different time period to early 2000s um versus this is you know early 2010s um, but, you know, I just like those dynamics of the character, all of them. Um, I, like, the villains are memorable. Father, you have, uh, what is it, the kids? Uh, no. Um, what's the rich kids? I already forgot the, the five of them. Four of them, five of them. I forgot what they are. Um, but, you know, I enjoyed that. All the, uh, you, you know, missions and whatnot they went on. Um, I, the, the movie, you know, going to the moon and whatnot, you know, finding out his dad was, uh, was it original number zero or whatever. Um, like I want a sequel and there, I don't want to say there were potential plans, but there was something going on in the background. Um, there was a petition for stuff that, you know, kind of died out and never really, you know, came to light. There was a, you know, a secret little thing of, you know, a, an adult, uh, n number one, and uh, you know, it just never came to fruition. Um, never really, you know, didn't want to continue it or whatnot, and that's kind of probably on Cartoon Network. But like, I, I, if for if you have not seen this show, I don't even know how to describe. Just just go watch. It. I, I I don't know how the best way to describe it is. It's just, it's good. It's so good, and it's so hard for me to describe it because there's. You know, character arcs, which I thought were very good in this. Uh, you know, the the ending, the movie and whatnot, I thought was very good to this. I thought I think the villains are very good to this. I feel like, you know, maybe if I watched it now, I feel like I would kind of understand some of the more adult characters. Because uh, obviously, you know, when you're a kid, it's like, oh, I don't want to be an adult. They're fighting adults to, you know, try to stay kids forever and whatnot. Um, so I feel like if I, because I haven't really, I, I've seen the movie recently again, but I haven't really watched like the show again recently. So I feel like I would understand that more as an adult now, um, you know, or differently than when I, you know, saw it as a kid. So, uh, yeah, that's that's my tier list here for Cartoon Network. Again, later on this month, I will do Nick. 
I will eventually get the Disney Channel. Oh, I, old Disney Channel was very good for me too. Uh, you know, some of these right here, if you've seen them, let me know your thoughts on them and whatnot. But uh, this has already been a long video, probably about like 25 minutes or something like that. For now, though, like the video, share the video around, don't subscribe, and I'm out of here. Peace.